Gamar Jovat, Daniel Ivar, Mshidovis Corpusis Mohalise. Mevar Keti, Mshidovis Corpusis Mohalise. Me Brahmi Var, Mshidovis Corpusis Mohalise, Sacred Fellowship. Me Mikvia Bini, Dame Mshidovis Corpusis Mohalise Var. I have today signed an executive order providing for the establishment of a Peace Corps. Peace Corps had actually been on my radar for quite a few years before applying. I loved the idea of being able to live in a foreign culture, getting to learn about a culture, learning to speak a language, and getting to share my experience with other people that I think could be useful to others. I always wanted to serve others and work in the public sector, but after studying political science at university, I still wasn't sure what the best way to do that was. So as soon as I found out about the Individual and Organizational Development Program here in Georgia, I was super excited. Well, Peace Corps had always been a dream of mine, and I had never heard of Georgia when I was received my assignment to this country. and. I did a lot of research and fell in love with it, and it has far exceeded my expectations. My first weeks and months were very exciting and eye-opening. I had to learn a lot very fast about the people, the culture, the work environment, but it was made much easier because of the support from an assistance that I got from my counterpart, my host organization, my host family, and, and Peace Corps Georgia. Peace Corps was established in 1961 by President John F. Kennedy. Since its founding, its enduring mission has been promoting world peace and friendship through its three goals. Goal one, strengthening local capacity. Goal two, bringing America to the world. And goal three, bringing the world back home to the people of the United States. Over the past 60 years, American volunteers have served in more than 140 countries worldwide working hand-in-hand -hand with people at the community level to identify and address local development needs. They've embraced the cultures of the people with whom they've served and shared American culture and all of its diversity back with them. Soon after signing the country agreement with the government of Georgia and the Memorandum of Understanding with the Ministry of Education and Science in 2001, the first group of Peace Corps volunteers landed in Tbilisi. I still remember all the excitement of preparations and meeting the first group. My name is Sonia Follett, and I was in the first group of volunteers to ever serve in the Peace Corps in Georgia. My first few months in Georgia, they were a complete roller coaster. Uh, there was so much to take in every day with language lessons, cultural lessons, learning how to teach in Georgian schools and with a Georgian counterpart. It could be really overwhelming at times, but it was such an amazing opportunity for growth and resilience building. I was a little girl in a little town of Gori when I heard from my mom, who is an English teacher, that we would have an American Peace Corps volunteer named Sean at our school. Sean, a G1 volunteer, was a great teacher of English who helped me grow personally, increase self-esteem, build confidence, and open new world of opportunities that I did not know existed. I don't think any of us realized how much impact he had on a 10-year-old Gulika, who later became an exchange student, studied in American high school, and then became a Peace Corps Georgia staff member. Peace Corps volunteers build ties that bind the people of our two nations together as respected friends. These are genuine partnerships and relationships that grow into lifelong friendships, almost like family. Peace Corps volunteers living and working in Georgia demonstrate how valued and respected your country is by Americans. Our citizens are ready to support you right down to the school and village level and help you build a peaceful and prosperous Georgia.
I really enjoyed when I'm at school hearing my students come to me and say how much they love having, loved having me in class and how I made classes fun. And I think what was important about that was when I worked, we had a good relationship with my counterpart teachers and we were able to collaborate and be creative and provide interactive lessons that brought out the best in both of us when we were teaching in each of our classes. One of my favorite activities that I believe was definitely a catalyst for positive change in my community was running on a regular basis throughout my community and throughout the surrounding communities. I even had students join me because they also wanted to take on these components of living a healthy lifestyle. Another rewarding aspect of my service was the ability to provide students with experiences that involve learning by doing, so giving them practical and hands-on experience. I've just been thrilled to see my teaching counterparts and my school uh, connected to greater opportunities for training, learning. Um, they've participated in exchanges with the US and with other countries. So I've just seen my counterparts go on to train others and be amazing teachers and advocates for language learning, for Peace Corps, and for their students. Years of partnership with the Pisco volunteers are the most valuable and treasured years of my life. First of all, my students significantly developed their communication skills. Another one is that we implemented so many projects with the Pisco volunteers, and I can proudly say that some of them are still sustained today. Together with Peace Corps volunteers, I experimented with teaching literature, project-based learning, and content-based instruction which helped develop my students' critical thinking and creativity, as well as their English language skills. Increased capacity, and increased capacity in individuals, in, in the organization, in my host organization. Mohalisestan ertad, chuan gavi umjobeset projektebis ceris, martvis, gunduri mušaobis, strategiuli dagegmarebis da komunikacii zunarebi. The strategic planning processes that we conducted at both of the organizations I worked with uh, have enabled them to continue to grow their programming and make a real difference in the community. We come in with these grand aspirations of world peace and friendship, but along the way we figure out the only real possibility of making even the slightest bit of progress towards that goal is to develop really strong interpersonal relationships and better understand each other. Georgia is known for its wonderful food and wine and nature. My favorite thing by far are the people and the relationships that I've built um, and, and the opportunities I've gotten to know some of the most incredible human beings that I've known in my long life. What I really cherish about my Peace Corps service is it's the friendships. Um, I've made friendships that have endured for the past 20 years. I think one of the first Georgian words that I ever learned was stumari. And I remember one of our cultural trainers explaining that guests were gifts from God. And I just, I love that. And it's something I've really tried to embrace upon my return to the U.S. Seeds were planted for relationships that have grown over time and continue to grow. I value human relationships most of all. Our bonds will last a lifetime. Since 2001, Peace Corps presence grew. Through our three programs, more than 900 Peace Corps volunteers have served around Georgia and partnered with almost 500 schools and local organizations. They worked directly with 70,000 youth, teachers, organizational staff, and other beneficiaries 
contributing to the English language skills development, organizational capacity building, sustainable project development, and cultural exchange. What does Peace Corps Georgia mean to me? Opportunity. Reciprocity. Endless opportunities. Magical. Fit realizacia integracia. Heartwarming. Kaziareba da professionalismi. Zrda. Sazo gadoeba. Experience. Nourishment. Mas pinzloba. Megobroba. An incubator for relationships and development. Shesad zleblo baby. Inspirational. Creativity. Aktiori mokalateoba. Bedneereba. Catalyst for positive change. Ojahi. Sharing cultures. Education. Urtierto baby. Life changing. Toilet Perry. <laughs> <laughs>